All right, so in this video, I'll be going over how we're helping our clients close $536 million brands. And our clients are marketing agencies. We obviously only work with marketing agencies. And this video was inspired by seeing this Slack notification uh, yesterday. And this is for one of our new clients, Zach. He's an absolute legend, delivering amazing results for his e-commerce clients. And I saw this message, and I saw it was with Illy Cafe. Now, Illy Cafe is a 10-figure company, right? They are a 10-figure company. So I looked them up, and what I saw was hmm, reported sales of $536 million in 2021, okay? Now, I don't know about you, but if I was helping e-commerce brands, whether that was web design, pay-per-click, I don't know, SEO, CRO, whatever it might be, I would want to work with Illy Cafe because everyone knows who they are and that would be an insane case study, okay? So I saw this message and, you know, they're a very big company. And then what I saw was on the same day, within a few hours, we also booked a meeting with 5-Hour Energy, right? And 5-Hour Energy is a another big brand, right? Sales totaling $190 million. Okay, and this is in one day within the span of a couple of hours. So imagine if you're running an e-commerce agency, if you're running any sort of marketing agency, imagine you could get in contact with brands doing hundreds of millions of dollars every single year. Like, the thing is, if they're making that much, they'd be willing to pay you tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, millions, if you could get them results. And if you're even half good at what you do, like you're gonna get an insane case study because imagine you sign Illy Cafe. You could sign literally any other coffee brand, literally any other one that is smaller than Illy Cafe because you can say, hey, we helped Illy Cafe to get these results. Like you have just won the game. You have just won the game. So I must give credit though. I must give credit to my partner Josiah because he runs this side of the business, the campaigns, and he is the genius behind booking these meetings. And firstly, if you don't know who I am, my name is Ethan Walby, founder of Agency Growth Partner, or co-founder of Agency Growth Partner. And we help established marketing agencies increase revenue by 50 to 100K a month within six to nine months by building out client acquisition machines. And a part of phase two of building the system is the lead generation, getting them in contact with these type of, you know, hundreds of million dollar brands, right? So the first thing that we do for our clients is they need to stand out and they need to charge more. So the problem with most agencies is that, you know, they're great at what they do, but they look like everyone else, okay? So you might be offering paid ads, you might be offering SEO, web design, all of it. But if you look like everyone else, you're just gonna be seen as a commodity. You're just gonna be seen as just another one of those. So the first thing we do is allow you to st or build out a brand new offer, which allows you to stand out. This also allows you to raise your prices while closing more clients, while booking more meetings. It's a no brainer because thing is you can charge five times more, 10 times more, 20 times more by doing the exact same work, but just working with different people. So for example, if you ran paid ads, right? But instead you helped like pizza shops, you're not going to get paid much. But if you ran paid ads for Illy Cafe or 5-Hour Energy, you could charge tens of thousands, 20,000, 30,000, 50,000 per month. So that is one of the things I recommend, right? So we started by doing that. Phase two is the lead generation system and phase three is the sales system. And if you want more info on that, uh, you can just book a call with someone on the team by using the link below or myself potentially. And we'll just walk you through how the entire thing works and how you can implement it for your own agency. So, like I was saying, the genius behind these campaigns is Josiah. Again, all credit goes out to him and also to Marge as well, the amazing team for booking the meeting firstly. Uh, so, I just, I just talk about it. I just talk about it because the team is that good. So, some insights as to how you can do the same, firstly, is that we're not doing anything crazy, okay? I mean, we're doing some pretty crazy stuff in terms of results, but what we're, we're not doing anything 
Actually, I'll take that back. So the first point is that people don't want personalization, they want value, right? So I see a lot of people, they focus on the wrong things. When they're sending emails, when they're sending LinkedIn messages, they focus on useless things. So like a lot of people, when they send emails, they try to personalize it to the, to the highest degree. So they start emails with, hey, John, congrats on, on graduating from Minnesota College in 2014 and on your dog's anniversary. Like, thing is, that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter at all. What people want is value, and they want proof that you can deliver. So instead of worrying about how to personalize emails, think about how can you provide as much value in the email as possible. And value can come in different forms. It could be in useful information, but like you could offer sending them a free resource, sending them an audit, something to that degree, or you could just talk about people you've helped in the past. So instead of instead of relying on you know copywriting hacks and advanced words and persuasion and NLP and sales tactics, rely on what you've done in the past. So instead of trying to like come up with the craziest copy or the craziest text, just talk about what you did for another extremely similar brand in the past. So if we were reaching out to Illy Cafe and our client helped I don't know, some other coffee brand, we would just talk about what we did for them and that will allow them to get onto a call because it's so similar. And I'll go into more detail on this in a minute. Then, obscurity, not being known or being forgotten is your biggest enemy, right? Your competition isn't all the other paid ad agencies. It isn't all the other marketing agencies. That's not your competition. Your competition is a constant fight against not being known. Because people can't buy, people can't buy from you if they don't know that you exist. And the thing is, people might know that you exist for a little bit, but then they forget. So you need to stay top of mind. And there's a couple ways to stay top of mind. The first one is posting content, right? Every time you post, they'll see you. But secondly, in this example, for you know, to get like someone like Illy Cafe on, they're obviously not seeing your content, most likely. So the way to stay top of mind is follow-ups, okay? But follow-ups following point one, because we're not gonna send follow-ups just to annoy them. We're not just gonna say, hey, just bumping this up. Hey, did you get my last message? Hey, 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 because you sound needy, right? So what you wanna do is provide as much value in the follow-ups as possible. So you could say, for example, you know, just add another case study. It's like, hey, Hey, Nam, hope you're doing great. Just forgot to mention that we also helped uh, 12 other coffee brands to achieve an extra 12.8 million per year in combined sales. Um, we'd, love to have, we'd love to do the same for you. 